quarter final, quarter final number three. It is the Solomon Islands up against Vanuatu. Solomon were impressive yesterday, and they will be can, eager to continue the form of Vanuatu. They fight to the very end. And Nick, this should be another Pacific Island showdown. Yeah, it should be looking forward to seeing what the Solomons can bring here. They were impressive yesterday with two good victories. And Vanuatu are still looking for their first win of the tournament. They showed some really good patches yesterday. Strung together some good continuity. Played some free-flowing sevens. This should be a cracker. So we are set to go here. Quarter-final number three. And it'll be Vanuatu with first possession. And Peckan finds it to Angus Blake. And then back to Blake. Blake's a big man and he's strong. Look at the fan. He's so tough to contain. He gets the hands free as well. Does Angus Blake. 115 kilos, standing 192 centimetres tall. And there he is there at first receiver. And he fires the pass uh, to his teammate, Sublin. And they get the penalty there. High shot coming. So they play quickly there to Peckin. Peckin switches direction now to Blake. Blake, plenty of touches in the early exchange. He shows and goes to the big man and gets over halfway and just loses his footy. But the penalty goes the other way, holding on the call. So Solomon will have a chance to strike back, but not like that. They will. They lose possession early and Peckin scooped it up. And now Ruben looking for a runner. And Ronneth, he's dangerous with his feet. Opens up there. They've just come up a bit too fast. Have the Solomon Islands. And now Vanuatu through to Mukun. Now they spread it wide. Here's an opportunity now on the inside. There's a the flick pass. That is sensational there to Sublon. And Sublon will go for the line. And he will touch it down. Vanuatu, they strike first. Five points to nil in this quarterfinal. And what a ball that was. Bakotu on this right edge. Throws it out. The back door. And Vanuatu all over the Solomon Islands to start this game. This was the, the back door flick. Just brilliant. Draws in two defenders. Comes off his left foot. And great support play from Sublin. Looping around the back. So crucial in sevens to stay alive. Get yourself that second touch. And Vanuatu with the early score. Go ahead. Vanuatu, a bit of a, a bogey team. They can upset anyone on their day. And they've turned up this morning. Take an early lead, five points to nil. So Ruben restarts play, looking for Blake above the pack. And that one lands in the arms of Solomon Islands. And... Solomon haven't really had a chance to stretch the legs yet in this encounter. They have a chance now to do so. Trying to get something moving through Poya. And that's a good flick pass linking up there with Sade. And now it's back to Poya. Leave it green, the call there from the referee. And they didn't do so. So Solomon Islands go quickly now through Poya. Poya gets the hands free. Still going up the middle. Ruben's doing his best. But Poya for the line. Ruben... Gets back in track and he sticks the arm out there. That'll be a yellow card and referees all over that one. You can't be doing that on the ground. And they, they will lose the captain. Toya Rubin, the skipper, and that's a big loss. Poya, he's the danger man for the Solomon Islands. He's in everything for him yesterday. Sparks them again here today. Looking to hit back. Fajr Lima, he's dancing away and he gets, goes on a bit of a a ride there from Peckin over the top of the ball illegally says the referee and they go quickly now and Solomon Irons just a big sharp right foot step and he dances in and Solomon Irons they open the account a great bit of play there from the Solomon Islands yeah I think it was Matthew Quayner with the big left foot step he takes the quick tap right foot step sorry he attacks the space 
forces the defender to commit and then he just whacks off his right foot. Scores underneath the left upright. So it's two points of difference now. Seven points to five. Good to see the flags on display early on day two action here at North Rugby Club. And that one taken in the air on Angus Blake. So they get the penalty to Vanuatu. A good tight tussle here early in this men's final. Both teams attacking well, finding some good rhythm. Vanuatu showing some good team play through the middle before Ronath is swallowed there, but it's high. So they will go again through Peck and he Tries a bit of footwork and Solomon Island's well contained here and good dancing feet. Angie the fend as well. Fenuatu making some inroads. Sublin goes into scrum half and that was out. So it's play on, says the referee. And Solomon Islands continue up the middle. And they get their second try. And guess who? He scored the first try moments ago. Matthew Wayanar and he gets across. And that is a great bit of work there from Solomon. Yeah, just some good heads up play here from Wayano. As you said, the ball's out. Vanuatu just take their time. He recognises that, swoops in, gets their second try. Great heads up play from Wayano. He's got an early double on the Solomons. They hit back, bang, bang, and all of a sudden they're in front. Vanuatu, a bit short shot goal. The ball was out, and Wayano said just came through. Scooped it up and he did the rest. Good knowledge of the game. So Solomon now with that converted try takes him out to a 14-5 lead. <laughs> they try to be a bit sneaky there off the restart. You need to be behind the line, eh? not in front. <laughs> you need to be behind the line, says the referee, laying down the law. Behind the line. So second time's a charm. This time he goes a bit deeper. And Venuatu. Taken there from Bakakoto and Sublin flings it wide to to Mukun. That's a loopy old pass, and he goes Roneth. Roneth, he's got some wheels about him. Roneth down the touchline gets the fend going, and that ball's come off the head of the Solomon Islands player, and it's gone backwards. So now it's.